I'm Mark Greenlaw. I'm the Vice President of Sustainability and Educational Affairs at Cognizant. We believe that there is a shortage of technology workers and for, for our industry. Uh, becoming a citizen teacher was really important to get right down there where the action is, rolling up our sleeves and not just sitting on the sidelines. And the apprenticeship was called Techno Swag. There were sixth graders. Um, a di diverse set of backgrounds uh, from this neighborhood. I'm not a professional teacher. Matter of fact, this is the first time I had done something quite like this. Kids chose uh, an image, put that on an iron-on transfer. We ironed on a piece of fabric, and then they had to design a pattern of how of these LED lights and how they wanted it to, to light it. We use this device called a LilyPad Arduino. It's an open-source microcontroller and then they use conductive thread to sew from each of the leads on the Arduino out to each of the leads on the LEDs. Then they had to program it. Now, having done these projects myself, I had never been able to get more than four LEDs to light at one time because the battery that we use, a little rechargeable lithium-ion battery, doesn't have enough juice to light more than four once. I had taught this one boy, Ohani, how to do the programming, and he had um, picked it up really quickly. And he had all eight of the LEDs lit at once. Then I said, oh, honey, how did you do that? How did you get them all lit? And he said, well, they really aren't all lit. I just lowered the delay time down to 10 milliseconds. So it looks like they're all lit. So what really impressed me was, was that he figured that out, that that was a way to kind of overcome that. And he actually taught me something. If you can go in and manage a group of 12, 15, or 20 sixth graders, then I can tell you that you can probably do pretty well in managing a, a tough meeting with a client. Our employees feel that the opportunity to be a citizen teacher gives them meaning and purpose in what they do. I was really surprised at how much the kids kind of got inside my heart and my mind and kind of was all consuming. And I have a pretty busy schedule and I travel a lot and juggling the 10-week apprenticeship really took a lot of commitment. There was nothing you could do to prevent me from making sure that I was in Boston at the Irving Middle School every Tuesday at 3 p.m. for 10 weeks plus our wow.